YouTube. Today, I am going to be ranking your favorite Honkai Star Rail characters based on their attractivenesses. Thisness. Yeah, no, that works. Okay, it is completely 150% subjective. So the tears are, this character is literally so hot, I need life insurance. That is one extremely attractive character. Pretty, cutie patootie. I understand why people think they're attractive, but they're just not my type. No, and then child, right off the bat. Wait, is Hook not on this list? Wait, did they just not add Hook? I'll edit in a Hook right under the child section. Danny boy, Danny boy, Don Hung, Don Hung. He is an objectively attractive character. I do understand that. I would pass, personally. Just not my type. I'm not into nerds. <laughs> like... 4.2 GPA looking nerd. Maybe this sanctuary is really but a vision. Serval, do I even need to justify where I'm about to put her? Serval is objectively one of the most attractive characters in the entire Honkai Star Rail universe. Tell me a character that can beat her in pure, like, personality-wise, like, actual personality. She's one of the most fleshed-out characters. Attractiveness. Like, she's literally so hot for no reason. Like, why? Like, she, her... Oh, my gosh. She's such a pretty character to look at. Like, you look at her, and you're like, well, she's gorgeous. Like, this is objectively a beautiful person. Like, oh, my God. I think Serval is prettier than Kafka. I think that's a hot take. Kafka has an energy that is insane. But I think purely aesthetics-wise, I think Serval beats Kafka. And I love both of them, mind you. You know, it's different. It's different. You know, the grass is always greener on the other side you see kafka in her toxic glory and you just want to bark it's the makima effect gamers we, we are all victims of the makima effect feely feela feel whatever the hell you want to call her i personally think i think she's pretty i think seely's pretty i don't think seely is hot <laughs> dwayne johnson <laughs> i'm so sorry i'm so sorry i i, I said seely but i was showing you guys a picture of dwayne the rock johnson I apologize. That's my bad. That's my bad. <laughs> All right. Honestly, Seely might even be under cutie patootie because I look at Seely, I, I call her cute. But like, I think she's pretty. I think like objectively she is pretty. Pela. I like Pela as a character. I do. I relate to Pela as a character. I think me and Pela would get along very well in the Honkai Star Rail universe if I was included. But listen. <laughs> I think she is pretty, but like when her glasses are off. I'm just gonna put her in the no category. I just don't have the urge to look at her. She just exists, but not for me to look at. She She's just there. I'm sure she's someone's type, and I'm sure someone has Pela as her favorite character. And I love that for you. Arlen. Okay, Mr. Sampo. Sampo Kaski. The red flag. I think... Sampo Kaski. I kind of want to put him in the cute category. I kind of think he's cute. He is problematic, but he has like a smug little grin on his face that's kind of adorable. I, I think Sampo's cute. I know, guys, I know this is coming so left field from me. I like never talk about Sampo, but he has like a little like, he has like a little like smug little three face. Herda. I think Herda's pretty. I, I don't I don't need to think uh, too hard about that one. I have a theory about Herda that may or may not come true. I don't know. What if Herda's actual form is hot? Imagine Herda's full form is like proper hot. I like an adult Herda. Oh my god. I I want that. I personally want that so badly. He's over a century old though. Okay, and Himeko or chapter nine if you want to call her that. The one needing life insurance is Himeko. You're right, I should put her in that category because she needs life insurance because she's not safe. <laughs> I'm not wrong. You know I'm not wrong. <laughs> Asta. Asta, my love. My beloved Asta. I think Asta is very pretty. I'm putting her in the... Mm. Or should I put her in cutie patootie category? Ooh... Is she pretty or is she cute? Wait, I'm, I'm second guessing now. Is she pretty or cute? I mean, do we really want her to be next to Sampo? Do we want to subject poor Asta to being next to Sampo Koski? Jepard. Little Jeppy in the house. I love this man. He is going to that. That one is, is one extremely attractive character. No, he's not cute. He's attractive, okay? The blonde bias again. <laughs> Let me live. Let me live. Listen, the Landau's? 
are are very attractive characters they are they are just an attractive family i can't help it like it's their genetics bro it's in their genetics mr welt he's just an old man i'm okay i understand why people think well is attractive i'm I'm, he's just not my type. He's just, he's just a, a peepaw. It's time to go home, peepaw. But for, for the Welt lovers, I know Welt has a very dedicated fan base. Bronya. I think Bronya is extremely attractive. I think Bronya is one extremely attractive character. I think she's, she's prettier than pretty. I, I think, I think she's prettier than the pretty category personally, which is going to confuse a lot of people with my next placement of Silver Wolf. <laughs> Hey guys, Mina from the future here. I was editing this video and I got to the part where I put Silver Wolf in the no category. I just wanted to say a slight disclaimer. This was recorded before Silver Wolf's trailer. I have been converted to the Silver Wolf faction, so I apologize. I love her so much. I would probably put her in the cute category now, but disclaimer, don't kill me, Silver Wolf fans. I am pulling for her now. Her trailer convinced me. I think I, I may have a slight inclination to not be fans of shorter characters. I don't know. I just think Brony is a prettier version of Silverwolf. Like, like, I think Brony is really pretty and really attractive. Clara goes into cutie patootie. She's a cutie pie. We love her. Natasha. So Natasha, the doctor. She is one extremely attractive character. I bark when I see Natasha. <laughs> I love Natasha. I'm in a parasocial relationship with Natasha. <laughs> March 7th. I think March is a cutie patootie. I think I think she works better in the cute category than like any of the other categories. I identify with March on like a spiritual level. Jing Liu. So we've seen her in Jing Yuan's cinematic trailer. She was Jing Yuan's master. I am going to be putting her in extremely attractive character. I think she's a beautiful character. I'm going to be rolling for her whenever she comes out. Jing Chue, the most relatable character in the entire game. Jing Chue is a cutie patootie. I think she's adorable. I think she's cute. I love her. Ting Yuan, Jeppy move. Jeppy move. I think Ting Yen's a very attractive character. She hates us and we love it. And we love it. I ask for it more. I ask for it more. She is so fun. I think she's hiding something. I think she's sus. Shu Yi, I think I'm putting her in very pretty. I need to see a little bit more. I think she's on the hotter side of very pretty, but she's still like, like pretty pretty, you know? Wu Xuan, I don't think I'm going to spark controversy with this, but... I don't like her. I, I'm not a fan of Fu Xuan. Yu Kong, I think she's in the. Oh, I think she's in the pretty category. I, I think she's pretty. She's not my most favorite character. And honestly, if, I, if I'm being for real, she's probably not even in my top 10. But she's very pretty to look at. And I appreciate that. I think she has a nice tail. I would like to stroke it, even though I am not a furry. Su Shang, my baby sweet. Angel Sushong is a cutie patootie. I think she is literally so cute. I love her. Her little chicken, Blady. I can already sense the um the angry comments. I want to put him in the no category, but I do understand why people think he's attractive. I'm just not into it at all. No. If you don't agree with that choice, leave a comment down below. I won't read it. <laughs> Stell. Stell, my love, my my beloved. She's extremely attractive. I adore the MC so much. She is hands down the best looking MC that we have in every Hoyo game. Every single one. I'm sorry, Kiana. I'm sorry, Lumen. Move over. I'm sorry, Ether. You're not even included. Stell is the best looking MC that we have right now. Hey, listen. Okay. Yan Ching. I hate this little. He needs to pay for the crimes of whatever his Hong Kai Impact third character did. Jing Yuan. I don't find Jingyu unattractive. <laughs> what? That's why I didn't roll for him. I, I, he's okay. I, I, I get it. He denied us our walk with Mother Kafka, and so he got demoted from any type of placement. So you don't like the daddies if they're not blonde? You are 100% correct. Because Locha, <laughs> Locha's hot, bro. <laughs> Locha, <laughs> he is so hot. <laughs> 
All right, the moment everyone has been waiting for. Kafka, Mother Kafka, the one character in this game that makes me giggle uncontrollably. What would you guys do if I put her there? Don't worry, don't worry, gamers. She's going here. She's going here, you guys. <laughs> Actually, I'm demoting Himiko. Kafka's personality adds a lot to the attractive factor, which really, really just brings a level. It's Kafka has like the Makima effect, which really just like gets her claws into you and like you are like obsessed with her. Like an unhealthy amount. Like when I'm not looking at Kafka, I'm okay. But then Kafka shows up and I'm not okay anymore. Literally, like I'm not okay. Like it, it, it's horrible once Kafka shows up. Like I, I, I'm ashamed of who I am when I see Kafka. <laughs> And there you have, oh, wait, this list didn't have uh, Luca in it. Luca's a redhead. I'm not pulling up a picture. You guys should know who he is. I would put him in probably the pretty category. <laughs> I think I would add Luca into the pretty category. I'll, I'll edit him here, right here. If you guys like this tier list, make sure to leave a comment down below if you agree with me, if you disagree with me, if you hate me, if you love me. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe button so you don't miss any of my uploads. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye